It is another rainy day in Vancouver. Welcome back to another episode of One Meal at a Time with Oscar. Today, I'm taking you to Wabu Kuro on Abbott between Expo Boulevard and Kiefer Place. It was opened in summer 2021. Conveniently located one block from the BC Place and Kitty Corner from Costco downtown. As you can see from the video, they're not only a Japanese grocery store, but they also sell Japanese bento boxes at a reasonable price. Before we start the video today, I want to talk about the rising cases of restaurant staffs being verbally abused in British Columbia. Some patrons were refused service for not wearing a mask, or they forgot to bring their digital faxing card and ID. I just want to point out that every wait staff is just like you and me, hustling and bustling to make a living to support themselves and their family. For them to keep up and enforce all the regulatory changes is in itself challenging enough. There's really no need to shoot the messenger, if that makes sense. Okay, enough of my rant. I ordered a chicken karake bento box, an ikura don, and a Japanese black tea. The chicken karake bento box cost $11.98, which was very good for the price. Karake is a deep fried dish where a protein or vegetable is coated in potato starch and deep fried until crisp. Enough said. Let's open up the box and look at the ingredients. Along with the bento box are two containers with mayonnaise and shiracha hot sauce. As you can see, there are chicken, rice, and many sides including green beans with marinated meat, half a boiled egg, pickled daikon, wakami, which is a type of Japanese seaweed salad, sausage, and edamame. I like the variety of sides offered. Here comes my favorite dish. Ikura Don is a Japanese rice bowl topped with brilliant orange pearls of salmon roe. Wabukuro adds sockeye and Atlantic salmon sashimi in the shape of a rose to infuse this Japanese treasure with more flavor. I like to marinate the already cured roe in soy sauce, then load it onto freshly cooked rice. Satisfy your sushi craving with this salmon sashimi bowl. It is also one of the quickest fancy dinners you can put together at home. If you are making this by yourself, remember to let the rice cool slightly so that you can ensure the heat doesn't cook the salmon roll. Now dig in. Remember to like and subscribe my channel and I will see you in my next video.